Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, on behalf of VWSA, I'd like to welcome you uh, this evening, and thank you for coming, and to the media, thanks for uh, coming to, to our press conference this e afternoon. Uh, the University of Windsor Students Alliance is excited to be back in full swing with our new executive team we have here today, we have Matthew Dunlop, our VP Student Advocacy. We have Sukjat Singh, our VP Finance, and our VP Student Services, who is not here today, and he is at a conference, uh, learning how to best optimize um, the benefits that our students get from our services. We also brought along a few board members here today. Uh, you'll be hearing from them shortly. We have Larissa Howlett and Diana Liu. So, we are excited to be back here at, you, uh, at uh, the Windsor Star to announce for the fifth time, for the fifth year, what has become, uh, what have become Windsor's largest and greatest music festival, the Coming Home Music Festival. The University of Windsor students and the Windsor public are intertwined, and with our downtown campus rolling out um, this fall, we can truly say that Windsor is becoming a true student city. The UWSA's mandate is to serve students. As such, our strength is drawn from within the Windsor community. Uh, the University of Windsor and the students that we are mandated to serve are a major thread in the Windsor uh, social fabric, and the Coming Home Music Festival enhances and tightens that social fabric. The UWSA's mission has three mandates. To advocate for students, to represent students on all levels in all aspects, and to serve students in all capacities. The UWSA Coming Home Music Festival is an important part of a way of providing uh, service to our students. But more than that, it's a way to welcome back 15,000 new and returning Lancers. Uh, before we proceed, I would like to invite Dr. Clayton Smith, our Dean of Students, um, to say a few words on behalf of the University of Windsor. Well, welcome everybody. Uh, this is a great event. Uh, it's been my pleasure to have been here five years in a row and to, to see the festival grow and flourish and do marvelous things. Uh, I think it's a special treat for us this year because the University of Windsor dreamed about moving downtown. We, I remember in the, perhaps that first year, we, it was a glint in our eye, and now it's actually happening. So this is no longer a celebration of what, what might be, but a celebration of what is. And the University of Windsor is extremely excited to become a full player and partner in things involving the downtown. Our Social work, uh, School of Social Work moves down here this fall. Our Center for Executive and Professional Education moves from one building to another, but also into that building. And then in another year and a little bit more, our, our Center for uh, Creative Arts will be down here. Our music, our, 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 uh, all of those, those kinds of programs will be here. And so it's very, very exciting for us. But the second thing is, and I think what's equally, more, equally as important, if not more important, is that the festival has become the gathering place for students who are returning to the university and students who are making this their university for the first time. And, and I have to admit, it is a phenomenal event. It's, it's, it's a little beyond me sometimes with the, the pumping music and all of the excitement, but I always go and, uh, and I try to take part in it as best I can and, and wish the new students and the, and the returning students great things. But anyhow, it's a super event. If you haven't come, been here, come. If you, if you know someone who you think ought to come, bring them. This is the event that opens our university to the world on, in our first week, and so be there. Thank you. Okay. This is our fifth year of the Coming Home Music Festival. As such, it is, is a, it is a tradition based on a vision, a legacy. 
In the earlier years when this all started, we weren't sure if we would have the opportunity to continue on another year. But as time has proven, year after year, we have built a momentum that cannot be stopped. Students and the public now expect another Coming Home Music Festival, and we have the duty to deliver. In the earlier years, it was marked with uh, certain varying degrees of uncertainty as to how this event would be financed. As well, over the years, there have been misconceptions as to how the festival and the talent would be paid for. In our fourth year, we developed a new funding model that positions UWSA as an equity partner in moving the festival forward. The Student Association, as well, plays a foundational role in bringing this world-class event to the University of Windsor community. We are proud that we are able to ensure that this event is sustainable, conceptually, financially, and legally sound. The Coming Home Music Festival is a unique event because it draws industry professionals from both locally in Windsor as well as from across North America to execute the largest and greatest electronic music festival that Windsor has ever seen. UWSA members and U Windsor students can be proud to have done the work to bring this exceptional event to their doorstep. This event was designed with students in mind as our primary guest. They do not have to cross the border. They do not have to travel north. We have brought to them this massive event that, you know, it comes with a reasonable price. We are proud to announce that after a successful year of Coming Home Music Festival, we are once again teaming up with Element Entertainment, which has been our partner since the inception of Coming Home Music Festival, and Disco Donnie Presents to bring you Life in Color, the Big Bang Tour. I've been playing Life in Color for years now. The show is just insane. The crowd goes nuts. It's hard well, like I say, it's wow, it's amazing. Hey, I'm Liv, I'm Mim. We're Nervo, and we just finished our second night of Life in Color. We want to be on tour with these guys forever. See, we got a pretty dark drench. We got wet every single show. We got drenched in paint. It's not even about just the music, it's about the whole experience, you know, it's about, you know, getting together with you and your best friends and just having a good time. video makes me so excited for September. Okay, so over the last few years, we have managed to bring in some of the best talents from the industry, and this year is no different. Some of Windsor's finest DJs are gonna start off the event by having a DJ battle, and for us, it's go big or go home. So on top of the explosion of paint, we have secured one of the best electronic music producers and DJ duo in the world. This unique producer and DJ is based out of New York and has one of the most popular dance tracks on YouTube with over 320 million views. Just to put that in perspective, that's 10 times the population of Canada. The artist has teamed up with some of the most well-known names in the industry, such as Snoop Dogg and David Hasselhoff, to create one of the most memorable dance tracks of 2014. They have performed at the world's biggest venues from Tomorrow World, the Ultra Music Festival to Madison Square Garden, just to name a few. 
And now they're coming to us, the city of Windsor, to grace the stage that has hosted many of the biggest names in EDM, Windsor Festival Plaza. And they are so thrilled to be playing at UWSA's Coming Home Music Festival. You might know them from their EDM hit, Selfie, which was one of the biggest dance tracks of 2014. Without further ado, the UWSA is proud to present you, our headliner, for the Coming Home Music Festival 2015. gentlemen, the chain smokers. We will be announcing their supporting acts over the summer. Tickets are on sale right now on www.cominghomemusicfestival.com. This year we're offering student discounted prices at $20 online and they will soon be available in the UWSA office. General admission prices start at $30 and limited VIP dry zone tickets for 19 and up are starting at $50. I would just like to invite JD back to the stage for closing remarks. Thank you, Larissa, and thank you, Diana. Um, <clears throat> personally, I've been part of uh, the Coming Home Music Festival for the last four years, as a, whether as a student uh, who's attending or as a volunteer. And I can tell you that it is more than just a concert for students. It is more than uh, just music. It's about forming friendships. It's about forming uh, relationships with your friends. And it's about bonds, bonds in the community. It's more about community than anything else. And about the city of Windsor and the University of Windsor and how we come here and it makes us feel at home. Uh, this is one of the largest and biggest uh, festivals put together as, by a student union in Canada and one of the largest festivals in North America and we're making it bigger and better and bringing it here to the city of Windsor all while being fiscally responsible.